Hello everyone, this is me on a college day, which was on a Sunday actually. I got woken up by my lovely sunrise alarm clock. Honestly, everyone should invest in one of these. So nice being woken up naturally. The light basically starts off like dim and then gets brighter and brighter and then plays birds tweeting as well. It's so nice. I literally got up, got ready and then made breakfast, which on this day it was porridge. I had gluten-free porridge oats and coconut milk. Of course, I had to add some toppings to my porridge. So I done chia seeds, cinnamon. I've also been incorporating a little bit of dairy in my diet now. So I used a natural yogurt and then some local honey. I actually decided to get changed again because that dress I was a little bit cold and we're not allowed to wear jeans on clinic days so I put another dress on. I decided to drive halfway to London because there was rail replacement and to be honest I just like having a sing in the morning so love that for me. I don't know why my camera cut out but there we go um i actually get really nervous to do them i don't know why because i'm quite confident but it's just scary because there's like three students watching and the supervisor watching so it does get a bit scary but after like 10 minutes of speaking i'm usually fine so hopefully that goes all good but i will keep you updated i didn't even make lunch or anything for today um oh my god i'm scared it's actually so sunny today what the hell I'll film later and keep you guys updated for the rest of the day. See ya! So it was literally a 20 minute train for me to get to St Pancras and then the walk from the station to my college is about 12 minutes so it's not very far. This is me just entering my college. Look, you can see all the lovely posters, herbal medicine, acupuncture, naturopathic nutrition. Lovely. I bought lunch from the cafeteria. Their food is always so nice, but a little bit pricey. So my client came in straight after lunchtime. This was just the little clinic room, which has a camera in it so my supervisor can watch and had my client it went really good i was so chuffed afterwards because i passed yay look at me and then this was me after college walking back to london st pancras to get on the train you say i'm too young for you people are probably looking at me because i have a camera on my dash oops i went the wrong way to the exit so guys, I'm back at Ebb's Fleet now and I'm just driving home, it's 20 to 7, so a college day is a long day, um, but it's still light so that's good. When it's in the winter it feels like really long because I come home and it's dark, so it's good that it's light and the sun is still out. I'm bloody hungry for dinner though. So I had a client in today, she was 26 and she came in and I passed the clinic so that's really good. I thought I had to pass three clinics this year but I actually only have to pass two but I've got to have three in. Three people in but I only have to pass two if that makes any sense but like the third one could be a pass or fail but like either way I've already passed two so like it's good. I hope that makes sense. Um, for like 10 minutes I was like quite nervous and like going red and then after the 10 minutes I feel like I've relaxed a little bit and got got the show on the road as one would say so that was good and then I made her a plan. I'm going to go home, write it up and email it to her as well because my handwriting was a little bit messy because it's like time pressure writing it down. We only have like 45 minutes to write it down. So they are not the glasses I want on. They're actually embarrassing ones. 
So I'm really happy. I really fancy a glass of wine now. You know, I've got to treat myself. I had a hard day. Uh, I think I'm in the wrong lane. Oh well. Uh, I need to be in this lane, okay. So I went in on a Sunday today, guys, and I usually go in on a Friday. So I got to see some of my old class, which was actually so nice. Um, I didn't realize how much I missed them, to be honest. It was actually so nice to see some of them. Like, I haven't seen them probably in like six months. So they were really helpful, helping me prepare for my clinic and like, just being like a bit motivational, you know, saying like, oh, you'll be fine. And like, yeah, just being nice. I had people to sit with on my lunch today, which is great. Usually I sit on my own. So I do need to bring in one more person to clinic, which hopefully I do want to pass as well. So if anyone wants to come in who lives near London, then let me know. What is going on with these cars driving? road rage like what the f i'm just gonna drive home have some dinner have a bath and just relax for the rest of the evening so i hope you guys enjoyed this video sorry i didn't film that much actually in college but like it's all confidential so it's really hard to film um but i will see you guys in the next video and thank you so much for watching and please like and subscribe if you enjoyed please subscribe because i really want 200 subscribers hopefully by the time this video has gone up i've already got 200 because i'm on 197 so you never don't know um but yeah i'll see you guys in the next one so thanks for watching now i'm gonna listen to music and sing my heart out i'll just say i was drunk too